Uh, the next step after they've been rough fleshed is they will have to be salted. So let's get to it. And the salt that I've got is uh, salt that I got from the local feed store. And it's, I find a scoop, a scoop this way. It's just a regular, uh, it's what they call meat salt or evaporated salt. You don't want rock salt for this. Uh, some people make the mistake of getting like livestock salt and that's rock salt and you don't want that. It won't penetrate like this stuff will. And that's the beauty of putting the uh, stopper out on it like I did. Is that if you, uh, if you don't try to clean them up ahead of time, your uh, salt is going to be a huge bloody mess. And with this, the, it just... The hides just turn out a lot nicer, in my opinion. And they're just cleaner and but I will salt this tonight and it will sit over night. And then uh, tomorrow evening I'll shake all this wet salt off and I'll salt it again. And then I'll just uh, kind of monitor it. But this hide that's in the back back here, this one, if you dry salt them and just let them dry like that, that's how they end up. They'll be stiff as a board. And I rehydrate that and then pickle it and then go ahead and do the tanning on it. But my battery is just about running low on this, so this is all we'll be doing for tonight. So I'll salt both of the hides and then we'll continue on after that.